Hello and welcome my fellow followers of Chaos to another Total War Arena video. Today I'll be showing off the Tier 4 Premium Cavalry for the Romans, the Auxiliary Cavalry. But before I go into that, today we'll be using Scipio Africanus, uh, someone who I haven't shown on the channel before. Uh, I have him up to Tier 4, he's the Assault Cavalry Roman General, so he's pretty much the only logical choice for these cavalry units. Um, so what we have is three three levels of Quick March, which... Uh, isn't useful for cavalry because it's a melee infantry only thing. Although it doesn't really matter anyway. We have a three level war cry, so that uh, that damages morale and stuff. And then we have Wrath of Mars. Um, so we're gonna look at the auxiliary cavalry. Now, uh, from appearances, you can see that these guys are pretty beefy looking. But um, actually, uh, I'll put on the screen here now uh, the stats of the citizen cavalry, which are the tier four equivalent for the Greeks. Um, everything is exactly the same except Citizen Cavalry have 12 additional armor uh, on top of this. So, these guys look beefy, but uh, <laughs> the Citizen Cavalry beat them out uh, in, pure, in pure armor. Uh, what it comes down to is getting the charge, basically. If, you, if these guys can get the charge, they'll beat the Citizen Cav and likewise. So, they're pretty equal, uh, honestly. It's just that these are the tier 4 Roman cavalry because the first cavalry you get that isn't premium is tier 5 and that is with the equites so it's basically just to get the Romans into the cav game at tier 4 and that's uh, that's exactly what these guys are pretty good at it's just that their armor is lacking compared to their uh, their rival but uh, anyway as you can see they have four consumables armor smith war steeds drill sergeant and weapon smith and I've decided to go with drill sergeant for the extra armor melee defense that'll help against uh, well that'll help in possible prolonged engagements that you can't run out of and war steeds which is extra melee defense well more extra melee defense so that's a uh, plus six melee defense there and plus four melee attack so uh, again it, it, these two just help with the prolonged engagements um, I decided to not go for the the um, straight up damage and attack and the armor because I, a lot of melee defense would would help but um yeah guys that's uh that's the auxiliary cavalry let's get into a game so welcome everybody to Thermopylae um yeah that's the map we managed to get uh, I'm just gonna go ahead and say this now this is a live commentary um I haven't played I don't play uh, ca I don't play cav all that often um, and I tend to be a very impatient person, so if I mess up, please do not hate me. Please. Uh, <laughs> now that we got that out of the way, I am going to try my best to uh, watch from afar and uh, strike where, you know, like in situations that Cav really should and not uh, try to be the infantry getting in the fight like I usually do, which is dumb. But uh, I've played a few matches before, and uh, that, that sort of happened sometimes. So I'm going to try to avoid that as best as I can. And... Um, I'll try to be as helpful as I can to my team. Um, we have a CPU, so that's not great. Um, unless someone can use him very well. But anyway, uh, let's take a look at these guys. I mean, they look pretty pretty darn cool. Um, but yeah, anyway, let's get into this. We have a l quite a few units of artillery. Um... Five. Five onagers. Very nice. Uh, Italian Noble Infantry is our bot. Am I the only cav on our team? Indeed I am. Okay, so I'm going to have to be smart. Which is horrible. Just, that's a bad thing. Because I'm not... Oh boy. I'm not the smartest person when it comes to this game. But, oh well. I'll try my best to uh, be as supportive. The only problem is I kind of need to be everywhere. And I definitely can't micromanage units all over the map. Oh, there's some preliminary firing right there. Didn't hit anybody. Okay. I think I'll stick to the low ground um, with these guys, but I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to park them around here. And um, that way I can react as the battle unfolds. Um, we're starting off at a bit of a disadvantage. Wow, look at these guys pushing into the middle of the hot gates already. These hoplites. And Toxotai. Taxotay? I don't know. Um, it seems like we got a pretty good hold on these cliffs, but uh, up here may be a little vulnerable if they decide to push. 
Um, all we have is the CPU going up there, so that could be a little rough. Um, it appears we have some noble infantry. Uh, if the artillery could start shooting at them, that would be lovely. There we go. Let's see if he can hit anybody. There you go. Good, like, quarter of that unit just got wiped out. Excellent. Um, let's see. Now, does the enemy have any artillery? That's the question. Yep, here it comes. It seems like they have two... Uh, two catapult-type units. Onagers, I don't know. Uh, these guys are doing pretty good, though. They're holding off, the like, four units. Um, let's go scout mid, because no one's there. And uh, we could be in big trouble if they're pushing mid with anything. So I'll go scout that out. And hopefully we don't run into anything. I haven't seen anything yet, so they're definitely not pushing it. But, um, who knows? They could be in these trees here. And there, there's some units. I would honestly be surprised if they didn't have units in this field. Uh, it te that tends to happen. But, uh, this might be a good, uh, this might be a good time for us. Actually, there's only one unit down there, so they definitely have everything around here. But let's see. Let's see if we can get uh, a few charges in here. Because there's some Toxitai over here, or Ionian Archers, or whatever they are. I don't know. I can't remember the unit name. Oh, there's some Spears. Definitely do not want... I definitely do want them, though. Go get them. Oh, they didn't get the charge. Crap. Oh, well, I'm not going to do very good against him. Not as good as I could have, but, um... It stopped these guys from firing at me, at least. Or from firing at my teammates. Yeah, I'm not doing anything. Get out of there. Oh, what happened to these guys? Was I being shot at, I wonder? Possibly. Okay, let's see if we can get these guys out of here. Spartan hoplites. What are they doing? They're gonna try to cut me off. Hey, just chill there for a little bit. Let's get up here. See if we can help out on this hill. Oh, am I being shot at? No, it's not me. Okay, good. Where are you guys going? Goodness, that was almost bad. Hey, just go down there. Chill, chill for a bit. Um, I would fight these guys, but this forest would pretty much destroy my cavalry. Um, so I don't... I guess I could help them shock. So I'll send these guys up. Uh, I'll put my general... Keep going this way. Okay, so this unit can just move around. Well, those Spartans are going for it. Okay, let's get up here so we can support this our teammates here. Let's see if we can uh, help break them. And we'll try to help out on this hill here. Oh, CPU was wiped out. That's not a shock. I am not surprised by that. Oh, is there anybody up here? We could easily take out this uh, this Onager and get some points there. Oh, wow. They, they, they didn't really need us. But we can help chase them down. And no, uh, this, this Onager was completely undefended. So that's good. Yeah, so we're free to uh, destroy these guys. That's good. Uh, we wiped out that unit. Now oh, these guys are going. Um, we've lost sight up here, of course, because our our CPU died. So, oh, there's some tasty skirmishers. We could get a nice uh, downhill charge on them. Of course, it will be in the woods. Oh, then then there's some swordsmen as well. Okay. Oh, there's a bunch of swordsmen. Never mind. Oh, there's some swordsmen there. Okay. Oh, well, there goes my general. Oh, for fuck's sakes. Well, try to kill some of them, I guess. And the charge just completely stops. Well, that's one unit gone. Just my luck. Stuff like that always happens. People may want to pay attention to that. 
Oh, they routed. Yeah, what a fucking surprise. Okay. But yeah, for like two seconds. Oh, I am the top player on our team, though, so. Whatever. That's not. That's not much of a shock. Okay, let's see what's in here. What are these heavy lithobolos? Okay, so that's just people that wanted to, that want to get back on their catapults. Let's get our cav moving in here. Um, we could be, we could be sneaky and take out all these guys actually. Uh, I could definitely take out these guys. I probably actually, you know what? Let's keep going this way. Let's take out this catapult. Oh, there's a bunch of stuff right there. Let's not be right in front of them. Okay, don't let them don't let them shoot the crap out of you. We still have this bigger unit here. See, I definitely don't look at me playing and say and think that I'm good with cavalry. Uh, definitely not. But you know, I just want to show you guys another premium unit. Because uh, I haven't really seen people do focuses and stuff. And uh, it's fun. It's fun to use premium units. Okay, apparently those pikes are faster than my cavalry. That makes sense. There we go. Ah, oh, they're dead anyway. Let's just get my guys up here so they don't just get slaughtered. It seems that most of my team has gone back to the base. Now, that is, that is nice because uh, they did push with a few units. But... Um, Hey, this unit actually survived, so I'm going to keep them moving. Yeah, there's no one at the enemy base now except for me, so there's n <laughs> there's really no point for me being here. So I'm just going to try to get out of here. But I mean, look at that. Three and a half thousand. That's pretty good. That's the best game I've had with them so far. So uh, we're definitely not doing terrible. Uh, the only terrible thing was letting that my general got killed. Uh, my general unit got wiped out. They must have got hit by archers or something. Okay, so this engagement's happening again, so we could get, we could help out here. Because uh, these Italian noble infantry could get wrecked by the combination of units that's here. And of course, the enemy artillery is definitely going to be punishing our units, so I might want to try to take them out. Um, does he get his pikes down? Yep. So those Italian nobles get absolutely decimated. Um, the best thing that I could do right now is take out the enemy artillery and uh, not worry about those pikes because they'll probably just get me killed. So uh, the enemy artillery that's here, I'm going to attempt to uh, take them out. But, oh, they have some pikes in their base. And they, they spotted me. Okay. That's not a big surprise. Oh, something just exploded. Okay, never mind. I guess we don't have to take them out. Because someone already got them. So I will just try to avoid these pikes. And we'll keep moving here. There might be another unit here that we can target. There might be some archers or something. So let's see. Anything? Oh, there's still one of those. Um, the pikes are probably around here now, though. So... Let's see if we can get this. I'm just gonna try to take them out with my last unit. Okay, there we go, good. Regardless if the pikes uh, came out or not. Okay, let's go. Let's get out of here. Well, we severely damaged that unit and uh, they're routing, so... We'll see if they can uh, do anything. And look at that. Look how much that put us up by. That, uh, that... I, I assume that helped the team, uh, taking out one of their onagers, but they're just going to get right back on it. But, I mean, stop them from firing for a little bit, at least. And uh, the threat at our base has been vanquished, so uh, we're in a pretty good spot here now. Hopefully, I can get a few more uh, rear charges or something as this battle comes to a close. But, um, you know, I'm pretty content. 4,000 4, points, it's okay. I'm glad that uh, this game actually managed to work out 
because uh, the games I was having earlier really demoralized me because I was doing really bad. Um, so I was like, oh man, I'm not going to be able to make this video. It's going to suck. <laughs> I don't know, maybe this does still suck, but at least it's not boring because I do shit. Okay. Yeah, they got the pikes and the Italian spearmen there. Okay, no problem. I can move. I can move faster than you. And th those guys are getting shot to pieces anyway, so it's no big deal. Um, I just want these guys to get engaged so I can rear charge them. Like, come on. Come in. Oh, here we go. Pikes are getting engaged. Now, I don't know if rear charging pikes still kills your cavalry or not. But, uh, I can... Uh, I'll hope that it doesn't. But I honestly would not be surprised if it did kill cavalry because stuff like that happens in this game. Oh, look at our artillery punishing those Italian spearmen. Excellent. Um, if there's any more, like, archer... There must be an archer unit or something over here. When I first came over here, there was a huge archer unit over here. I'm gonna see if I can find them. There's probably... I think there's another pike unit here. Oh, uh, there it is. They're running over there. Okay. See, I need these guys to be distracted, but they're not. Oh, yep. There's the other pike unit. I was right. Oh, it's a... What is it? Two pikes and an archer unit? That's what he's using? Yeah. Well, I suppose I could go through the base and just uh, YOLO charge these guys. That might work. Unless they all... Oh, never mind. They're all they're all going to die before I can even get there. So... Get some base cap. Get some base cap points. Uh, they came back. So, let's see what happens there. Oh, they're going for the base. Okay. I'll just run around. I'll be that guy. I'll be that guy that runs around in the cap. Just capturing. Italian spearmen. I definitely don't want to fight them. Uh, that's for sure. Okay, they're going that way. Pikes are probably going to be coming around here eventually. Oh, I'm getting shot at apparently. No! My one bane! Don't shoot me. Oh, there's more pikes. Yeah. Oh, Cav, where are you going? <laughs> Jeez. We're capturing the enemy base. Oh, that reset the cap. Yeah, I didn't even think about that. Right well, screw that. I'm getting out of here. I need you guys to fight so I can rear charge. Come on. They're not even worth rear charging. It's a little spaghetti line. Let's see. No, I want to go this way. Come on. Come on now. Oh, I got spotted, so they're probably going to try to chase after me or something. Some crap. Jeez, they really want me, apparently. Yeah, sure, just run around your base and get shot. I don't care. Does it bother me? No. You, fight. Oh, never mind, we won. Okay, good. Yeah, look at that. 274 unit XP, not bad. So let's take a look at what we actually got. <laughs> so guys, from that battle we managed to get 432 commander XP and a whopping 760 XP on these auxiliary cavalry. That's crazy. Now I am running a premium account, um, so that helps. But still, that's ridiculous. And this is a premium unit, so you don't have to spend any of this. Immediately, all of this goes straight to my commander XP. And bam, just like that. 1456 now that is that still isn't a lot compared to some people but like crazy and they're not even that expensive to replenish either it's only 640 and all three units are ready to go once again and now with that i can upgrade a bunch of scipio uh, abilities but i'm not going to do that because i'm saving them for another commander and um, another premium unit focus to come in the future so i uh, hope you guys are excited for that not going to spoil anything you guys will know when that comes out but anyway, guys, this has been the Tier 4 Premium Auxiliary Cavalry for the Romans, played by Scipio, or whatever, as Scipio. Uh, hopefully you enjoyed, and uh, I'll see you next time. Goodbye.